Um, I would just say a lesson that Coach L taught me was he always just preaches to me, just play freely and just don't worry about what's happening because sometimes you, you always um, – go through a drought or not playing so well but just just play freely and just go go about the game and just play play to the best ability and play how you how you play all all year um for me I always say that you know coach L he's a coach but he's also a teacher um you know he he breaks down everything to a point to where you would understand it maybe sometimes a little too much but um you know we have freshmen coming every year but um no, seriously, he, he's taught me just the effects of a positive attitude. Um, you know, like he kind of mentioned earlier, there's going to be obstacles that come up in your life, whether it's basketball, outside of basketball, that are going to occur. And just kind of having that perseverance and, and positivity, being optimistic to kind of push through it. Yeah, for me, I would say that it's these three words, attitude, class, and commitment. <laughs> you know, he always, you know, reminded me of that, you know, in any situation, you got to have a good attitude, good or bad, you know. Then, you know, if you committed to something, you're going to do it with, to the best of your abilities and always act in a first-class manner. Yeah, um, something I learned from Coach L is, you know, treating everybody, you know, with a positive attitude and, you know, always nice to everybody. Anytime I see Coach L, if he's walking around anywhere and somebody has stops and asks for a picture or autograph or something, he's always, you know, happy and nice to that person no matter who it is. You never know who you could run into and who that person could be. Um, but I see, you know, he taught me to treat everybody with a, you know, a positive attitude and be nice to everybody. Yeah, basically what these guys said, I really was going to say what Chad said, but he took it out of my mouth. <laughs> but, yeah, just uh, he told me a lot, just, like, being patient. And one thing that really stuck to me is, like, play the game, not the score.